with them out of the way, we actually need to head back north. Because we need to wait for this tide to go out so we can head... Oh, uh, you're not going to let me go! It's tide. The tide needs to go out for this. Maybe it's one more screen up. Uh-oh, it's starting to get light out again. Uh, we need to wait for the tide to go out. Ah, uh, it's too bad. I will be back here when it is night. Because we need it to be night in order to get over there! I was hoping that it was a little bit earlier. I'll be right back. Alright, back on the same screen and it is night. Now I can head over here and grab this. Give me some oak wood. I was trying to time that right. Unfortunately, I mistimed it just a little bit. Let's go back to where we were, which was on this screen. Very nice. Now we can head out of here. That's a that one's a tricky treasure chest. You gotta gotta do it at the right time of day, which is never that fun. Repeat enemies. So let's keep heading out of here. We need to head north, and we have finally made it. It looks like to the town of Wendell. This is Wendell, home of Sibba the Sage. Very, very nice. And we got here safely. We finally made it. He said, I guess you'll find Bogard now. Loki, you'll meet Master Sibba, right? I'll meet Master Sibba in here, all about the Sword of Mana. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay. Is she going to be hanging out with us? It looks like she is. Very, very nice. Uh, I'm actually need to do some level grinding, believe it or not. Uh, I'm actually under-leveled for where I am, probably because I keep on running away from everything. If we look at my stats, I'm level 15. I will be back when I am uh, level 20. There's also a treasure chest that we need to backtrack to get, so I will put that on screen, and then I'll, um, yeah, I'll get that, and I'll meet you back here when I'm level 20. Actually, I forgot something very important. We were one level away from a very important level. I am level 16 now. That's not what's important. What is important now is that I have five points in random. Random is my choice. And I have changed my class because of that. Got a nice level up, I must say. You know, intelligence, mind, and agility. Now I am a ninja, though. Ah, oh, this is going to be awesome. Alright, so my accuracy is up by 5, critical up by 10, evasion up by 10. That is awesome. I'm still looking for the thing that we need to backtrack for, because if you remember, there was a treasure chest that we couldn't get because we needed the flail. So I'm going to go back and get that still. And here we are. We're actually uh, on the east side. We're still in the Vinket vicinity. Uh, we have to go south one screen and then west one screen from the exit to the Batmo Cave. And here is the treasure chest we could not get before. Let's take a look at it. Hopefully it's worth my while. Cobra earrings. So if I so wanted, I... No, that's not it. That's not what I wanted to do at all. It's technically in the status screen. Uh, then we can go to armor list. And instead of having agility plus five, we could open up our accessories and we could get power plus five. I'm going to stick with agility though. That's just me personally. And then how do we get off of here? Just like that. But what I do want to do is use the magic rope which teleports me to the last place where I saved, which unfortunately was out here, it looks like. So I'm going to head back. Uh, well, this is still closer than where I was before, but I still need to head back to, um, to Wendell so I can do more of my level grinding. And before I forget, we have defeated another boss, which means we need to talk to Little Cactus again. Now I've already spoken with him, and he wrote something new in his diary. We have Fighting Hydra. The chief went out and fought a mirror marked with the moon and all, but carrying it around seemed queerer than hanging it on the wall. Weird. 
Weird. Uh, now, there are optional ones. I believe the optional ones start here at 18 or so. 18 or 19, somewhere around there. These are all optional quests. I will be doing all of them. You could have completed a couple of them if you turned in the blood pouch, uh, but I would recommend not doing that. Speaking of side quests, uh, the wind coins and other sorted trait coins, I would recommend that you hold on to those. Do not use them in battle. There is a good reason for that later on. Now I need to finish up my level grinding and I'll meet you back in Wendell. Alright, it looks like all my level grinding is done. I am up to level 20. As you can see, I am no longer a thief. I am a ninja. Ninja Loki. Loki the blonde ninja. So I have been doing almost all my level grinding on the flail. As you can see, it is now up to uh, level 7. I do like it more than I like the sword, uh, but you do want a well-rounded character once again, just in case you happen to find an enemy that's only weak to one of those things. Uh, I did try to do some uh, level grinding on Undine Undine. Uh, unfortunately, I only got to uh, level 1. As you can say, it's Salamander Day today. What that means is that if you were to use Salamander, it would have an increased effect because it's his day. It's his special little day. I have put all my points into Thief since I got up to Ninja, so now I am uh, 14 points Thief and 5 points Random. Uh, Misa, I guess, has been doing some level grinding too. She, I don't know. She's not nearly as good as Loki. Just not even close. No, she's not. Uh, I also have been picking up a few items, one of which is very important. Um, the one that I'm particularly thinking about, uh, because there is a lot that we can do in Wendell, uh, the reason that I chose to level grind uh, at this particular point was that so I could get this item. I have picked up, uh, well, not only the cactus essence and the moon mirror reflects the true nature of things. How very nice. I have picked up the glittering sword, an unequipable, unequipable shiny gold sword. Not that it'd be very good anyway. Gold kind of sucks in terms of hardness. Anyway, uh, you can get these from the crabs uh, that are just outside of town, so feel free to level grind on them like I was doing until you get at least one, but you only need one. Keep that in mind. Uh, in terms of seeds, I have quite a few new ones. They all say the same thing. A plant seed, the spiny seeds that we're getting off the crowds. That's why I have so many of those. Uh, of course, you have the big seed, flat seed, crooked seed, long seed, oblong seeds, just tons of seeds. Um, raw materials, I don't think I picked up anything new. No, I did not. We had that before. In terms of recovery items, I don't think I picked up anything new. I didn't. I think I got another magic walnut somewhere along the line. No. And then, um, let's see. Meat items, I did pick up something new. I did pick up fish meat. It helps fight aquan foes. Once again, off the crabs. So feel free to grab that off of them as well. And then mystery items, I, yeah, I don't get anything new from them. So, that is it. We have a lot to do in the town of Wendell, as you might imagine. There are actually five side quests that get started here, so let's see how many of them I can get off of memory. Your skills improve as you fight enemies, as your skills improve, so does your attack power. Yes, thank you. The, the, the concept of leveling up is apparently foreign in this world. Whoa, that was kind of weird. I was like, I glitched right through Misa. That was weird. Whatever. Back when the Dark Emperor Vandal ruled the land, Simba used to round up kids and teach them about mana. This is the very place All we had then was a small church, but look at it now! He is talking about the cathedral, which we can't really see. It is up through there. We don't want to head there just yet. That will forward the plot, and that's the last thing we want to do. Vinket Hall, that's Ghost Mansion! Uh, thank you, little kid, but I was already there. Have I talked to you? Uh, no, I haven't! Uh, yes, there's talk of heretic hunters, but thanks to Master Silla, the town is calm, okay? See, look at that! I'm glitched right through her face! How the hell does that happen? Say, have you heard? The legendary Geminites themselves learned about mana from Master Silla! That's to say, Master Silla is becoming a man of legend himself! It's crazy. They summoned mana power, but you can't rely on power like that. I apparently am, since I have two of the spirits already. 
Sometimes when you fight, your body will blink. That's your chance. Keep holding down the A button and flash. Your body glows. Flash. That's when you let it go. It's like BAM! Kablam! Crazy kids. So yes, apparently if you made it here without knowing anything about level grinding or death blows, this is how you can find out. Thank you, uh, Random Town. I don't think I've spoken to you yet. There are so many monsters about. Stay strong in mind and body. Our, the cathedral's north. We don't have time for the scenic route. Damn you, Misa. I wanted to explore. So there aren't very many places that we can go to uh, through down here, apparently. So let's go in here, which is the General Stow. Let's go through and see what we have. I think I, I think having a cactus in the room adds a nice prickly touch. Don't you think cacti make lovely houseplants? Yes, I do. You'd look good in my house, too. You're starting to creep me out. Uh, what happens if I say no? What happens if I say no? Cactus are awful. Cacti are awful. Oh, dear me. I don't believe it. <laughs> do you have a minute? Sure, dummy. What's up? I want to ask a little favor of you. See, business has been down lately, so this brilliant idea just comes to me. We've got these ads. Fifteen leaflets and all. Made them myself. Do you think you could pass them around for me? Pay you for when you finish. What do you say? Yes! This is definitely one of the side quests. Yo, the best! Thanks for helping me. And now we have 15 leaflets that we need to spread around town. I believe the first person that we need to talk to is this woman right here. Ads! Ooh, gimme! Where are the bargains? One leaflet down! That was fast. Somewhere there's, there's a lucky black mask. It'll make you rich. If you find it, I'll give you 300. No, make that 500 lucre for it! Is that already quest number two? What's up, Mote? Do you have anything good for me while I'm here? Um, yeah, the same stuff that we've been seeing. I already got the Cobra earrings. I already picked up the Cicada earrings, which I'm already have equipped. So, uh, no, I'm good. Uh, she has a defense ring. She needs it. She keeps it. Well, she dies from time to time. Thank you very much. What items do you have? Anyway. Uh, same thing that, yeah, same things. Uh, once again, uh, Chocolate Lumps will give you, uh, a little bit of magic back, and Presto Veggies will cure poison, but I don't really feel the need for that right now, so I'm going to just hold on, uh, to my money. Now, there are a few people that we need to talk to in town uh, about the uh, the flyers, but to be honest, I will take care of them all at once instead of just walking around randomly talking to people. Uh, let's go through this door here. We have a residence. Very nice. Say, what have you got there? Barbecued Newt? That reminds me of a guy I met once who said he loved it. I think he was selling stuff for the blacksmith. So there's a blacksmith. Very, very nice. I would like to talk to this blacksmith. Ooh, I see a treasure chest in the back there. Guy who won't work. Oh, thanks. What is it anyway? Leaf something from what kind of tree? What? <laughs> Mom, I'm hungry. Mom, dinner now. It's human nature to want to take it easy. What's wrong with that? That's why people come up with inventions. Take me, for example. I refuse to do any strenuous work. People want two things, money and a good time, don't you think? Sure. Was that a yes? Use your head when you answer, will ya? What happens if I say no? So yeah, this guy... I think we handed him a, a leaflet, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I'll have to double check when I... When I well, when I do that. What happens if I say no? Is that no? You think you can just say no to everything? You speak funny. Give me that treasure chest where I find an oblong seed. Uh, yes. <laughs> the game is now won. I have an oblong seed. Those are useful. We'll go over those uh, later. Because even though I have played them, I haven't gotten any of them back just yet. Is there anywhere else I can go down here? Alright, now so let's head up north here. 